Hi everyone, welcome to Flash Animation Tutorial. Today we are going to do another project using different techniques in Flash Animation. Uh, let's have a look at the project quickly. As you see, there are three layers, and three layers uh, presents a text is coming up with the Beaky Company, and this animation also can be embedded over the uh, some websites before you go to home page. Example, you press center we can see it and uh, firstly the company name comes up and then after that something close it and then the text turns to welcome we can also apply this with control enter it's a pretty good animation it can be used as I said in the uh, you know welcome page of the website and then when, and then you can click somewhere and then go to the home page. Alright, today we will do this project. Um, I will take you to a uh, file new and action script 3.0 and after that I'm going to first do the text effect. I will write here text, uh, this is the layer 1 name. I'm going to click on the T and write my text. I'm going to write there uh, B key company all right if you want you can change the size of this color of this from here it's all about the uh, so some different uh, regular I would like to make this bold and right. if you want you can also change the the font style from here and after that I'm going to change its also size if you press hold on a shift uh, it's going to resize this with a good ratio or from the vertically and horizontally uh, without losing its quality okay I'm going to place it here but I would like to start this from the smallest size okay and then select the photo I mean text and you can press F8 for this to convert to symbol uh, I'm going to say OK and after that I want text to be enlarged in 15 frames timeline we'll click right insert a keyframe and as you see the photo the text is a small till 14 in the 15 I would like to make this the big size it will be very big like this and then I'll click right and then apply there a twin I made a classic twin and when you press enter you will see that text is getting big okay and then I want text little bit stay as a, uh, in this size for a while I can click right also insert keyframe as you see text will get larger a little bit and then it will stay in the same size and after that, after that, I want text to turn to another format. I'm going to click right here and insert a blank frame. Okay, and uh, I'm going to write there, welcome. I place it here. And then uh, I can also resize this. Hold on a shift and resizes perfectly okay we can minimize it a bit to make the size same with the previous text after that I'm going to convert to symbol by pressing F8 and say OK and then I will go to frame 45 in this timeline it will uh, get smaller I will get a uh, keyframe by inserting this far and then uh, here it's going to get smaller that's why I'm going to hold down a shift and then resize this to make it smaller and then right click there to apply the classic twin and as you see the text is getting smaller now it's time to do the block effect and uh, you know the text is coming from the smaller size to the biggest and here it's the you know changing moment and we're going to close this stage that and then after that we will see the welcome while this uh, stage is opening all right uh, I will go to get new layers and then name it block 01 
okay and I want from the block activate from this 16 or 17 frame for that reason I'm going to place here a blank keyframe and uh, I get uh, my tool over here if you want you can choose a different color alright and then you will draw a big stage if you want you can resize from here place it outside of this it's no problem the size but the important one is it's going to cover the length of the stage alright and uh, I'm going to give a roll to him. It's going to start from here and it will continue till this frame. I will press uh, F6 or I can click right and insert a keyframe. In the beginning it the block is going to stay there but in the end it will cover half of the text. Okay, and I will click right and make a classic twin. That's it. As you see it's closing. All right, and uh, by the way, I will do for another block because it, the first block only covers the half of this. Another half will be covered with another block. I'm going to get another layer, and right there, block zero two. Uh, I'm I'm going to right click here again, insert a blank keyframe. I can use the same block by uh, copy paste. You can use also shortcut Control C, uh, Control V and make sure you select the you have to activate this uh, block 2 layer so you can place e, the new block to the new layer I'm going to make control V and then take this out of stage first just like this one and right click here the same option same process I'm going to do right click e, insert keyframe and in the first it stays there in the end it's going to cover all okay and right click make a classic twin let's play this with control enter it's pretty good uh, the thing played role till here the blocks is going to stay there because we didn't animate them to open the stage they, they will just close it and now we will continue it the, just like we did just like we did in the uh, previous project you know the bouncing balls I'm going to select them all right click and uh, copy them and uh, paste here alright and I'm going to reverse them let's do the same thing for this part copy right click paste and select them again and make a reverse okay so it worked it's pretty good and you can also delete these unnecessary frames right click and uh, remove frames that's it here we go alright we did a great project thanks for watching and we will try to have a very joyful projects in the following tutorials uh, see you later bye bye